How Tenembu has carried his son along in his political ambition. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. When inequality that differentiates the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress APC, as Siwa Jibola met Tenembu from other politicians, is how he has been able to involve his family in his political aspiration. His son, Sheyi Tunumbu, has been actively involved in the consultation process since his father declared to run for the apex political seat in the country in January. When children of other notable politicians were abroad without getting involved in their father's political aspirations, Sheyi Tunumbu has been following the footsteps of his father in the political terrain. He was actively present during the recently conducted presidential primary election of the All Progressive Congress and evidently present with his father at the Eagle Square in Abuja to celebrate this year's Democracy Day on June 12. When the former when the governor of Ekiti State, Kaidi Faimi, went to introduce the Ekiti APC governorship candidate to Bola and Metinambu, his son was readily available then. Also, when the former Lagos State Governor met with the Governor of Fima State, Sheyi Tunumbu attended the meeting. Sheyi Tunumbu received an LLB from the University of Buckingham, United Kingdom in 2011, seems to be following the footsteps of his father, and Nigerians will not be surprised if he contests for a political office soon. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing. Something just caught my attention. Let me read it out to you so you know why I'm laughing. When you look at Tunumbu's wife's eye, you will see wickedness in the face of this. By any chance, she become the first lady of Nigeria. That means after wickedness, there will be no other wickedness. Why would the person, why would somebody come out to say this in the first place? Now, oh, wow. Hmm. He wants to teach them the lutein system. Well... Uh, he's not the first person to show his son politics. This governor, this uh, Akeri Dolu, the governor of Ando State, also has a son, you know, in politics as well. But are we surprised? They say, snake go always born waiting go long, Abe, and waiting they bite. Now, so it be. Okay. Mm. I'm just saying, you know, I'm not saying it's a snake. I just use that. Now, waiting enter my mouth, oh, I beg go. Oh, before they go misquote me, I beg. <laughs> okay. Um. That shows that he wants them to rule you forever and you will become their slave. As some of you are in Lagos, most people will see Tinubu as a god. Whatever he says and stands, as far as Lagos is concerned, I pity Lagos people. One day he will change the name of Lagos to his name. It will happen. If not him, it will be his son. Just imagine how they are praising him for bringing his son into politics. That is to show you that Lagos is his father estate. <laughs> Why are you supporting evil? Are you not tired of the hardships? So far, no, they tire you. You're experiencing in Nigeria. Now, what for some people? Hmm. They think Nigeria is Lagos. Some people are coming out to say um, it's not good, it's good. But the thing is, whether it is good or not good, Nigerians, now I get the decision to make. In other words, saying he'll be the next governor of Lagos State, I laugh in Swahili. About his father, he's hanging around it. Is it me that to be hanging around him? Since his health is delicate, it is his duty to hang around them because, as it is, him and his mother are the only ones he can trust. <laughs> this person gave word from Acha. What are the children of other contestants? Are they running from Nigeria? I beg me, can I not ask me? I don't know because if you ask me, I don't know who will I go. I don't know who I go ask. Okay. Well, uh, a lot of people are going to take this the wrong way, but um, to the people bringing the summit to party, they'll see it as, you know, they'll see it as uh, something that is not good. They'll see it as a bad sign. In fact, a lot of people are coming out to say, oh, more. Huh. what are they trying to tell us? Well, at this point, I want to believe in Nigerians, they know what they want, and then know what they, they, they know how they use one time. So, over to you people. If on a few say um, this person, if him bring his son, I go vote for him. No, 
弄完了。She is a very good son. I love the way he's taking very good care of his dad and assisting him all the way. Very respectful and hardworking as well. Very proud of Achagopan and his beautiful darling Pastor Remy's wife for a go good job in raising such, raising such a great son. Okay. Trembo should respect his age. Nothing will make him to run Nigeria. Lagos is his boundary. Get a PVC and let a PVC do the talking. She is a good and great guy like his father. I love them with their sportsmanship. On Trembo mandate, we shall stand. You're not a great guy. I wonder how some people reason so reason. So everything must still be from Tunambo's family. So nobody gets sense again for Lagos, if not for Tunambo. Now you are fighting for his father. Soon you will stay there and be fighting for his son. Can't the people be wise for once? There's where for your people with the family of Tunambo. <laughs> We're gonna leave me a man. Hey, it's a question. Hmm. Lagos State will soon be handed over to the son of Tunambo. Lagos indigenous citizens are the funniest people I've ever seen. But like I said, now Lagos people, now then go decide. Hmm. Now then go decide though at the end of the day. If Lagos people say they want to continue like that, no wahala. If they say they want not change them, no wahala. Anyhow, we then just want them, then go talk them. Because Lagos people then get their PVC and I won't believe, say they no could just sit down and things like this could happen. But if they choose, say now so they just want them. No wahala too. No wahala at all. If you ask me, I think, um, I don't know how it sounds, but, um, you know, if, let's say, what I said in Akiri the Loose Home, I was like, you know, because people came out and, you know, they started dragging Akiri the Loose for making his son, giving his son one, is it one political appointment? And I said, okay, fine. Let's even look at it from this angle. Is this guy working? He's not supposed to be, but is this guy working? Because I know that in civil service or in public service, your sister, as in a family from the same, as in if you bear the same son name, you don't get to work in the public service or civil service together. So I think they should uphold that in government as well. But nevertheless, like I said, Nigerian people, they don't get to decide. If they decide, say, if Lagos people decide, say, they want um, Tunubu Pekin as governor, huh? you did their hand. If they decide, say, they don't want, they still did their hand. Everything did their hand because this year, with the year this year, they, they open people and they wake up people, they sleep. We don't know, say, uh, uh, um, you know, we don't know, say, they don't they sleep since. So, we they wake them up, they tell them, which they're supposed to do. Hopefully, they are going to understand. Okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news.